Are we good? Are, are we rolling? Okay, let's begin. Grace, why don't you introduce yourself? My name is Grace. I'm 22 years old, and about two weeks ago, I swallowed my phone. And now every time I talk, I sound like a robot for some reason. Kind of like Siri, would you say? Sure. Okay, let's start with the obvious first question. Grace, how did you swallow your phone? Um, well, I wanted to film myself painting my nails for TikTok, but I needed both hands. So I put my phone in my mouth to record, but then I, I, I didn't like the lighting, so I went and I grabbed a chair from the office. Did it hurt? What, the, the falling or the phone going down my throat? Well, yeah, I, I am concerned about the falling part, uh, but for the purposes of what we're doing, I think it would be best to focus on the phone part. Gotcha. Um, no, no, not really. Grace, tell me what life is like when you sound like a robot. Well, it's, it's really hard to do basic things. I have a really hard time calling people on the phone. How come? They think I'm a robocaller. Hey, how are you? Mom, it's me. Don't hang up. Don't hang up. Dang it. For the first couple of days, the phone still had some battery power. Every once in a while, it would get a signal. How did the phone not short circuit your stomach? Waterproof. What has been the hardest thing for you during this time? I haven't been able to sing since my little accident. That's been really hard for me. I, I miss being able to control my voice. I miss the sound of my voice when I'm sad or angry. I'm really sorry to hear that, Grace. It's okay. It's just that you never realize how important the sound of your voice is until you sound like the speaker at the drive through That probably sounds really dumb, doesn't it? What are you trying to get out of the making of this documentary? Awareness. And also money for the operation. Having a phone in your stomach isn't exactly comfortable. Who has been the most supportive of you during this time? Definitely my boyfriend. We met in college at theater school. We've been together for about two years now, and somehow he's still the best part of my day, every day. He's the only one who can understand me, even when my voice is like this. What happened? A tangle with a flying saucer or something? Oh, nothing so domestic as a flying saucer, officer. Hey Siri, what's the weather going to be like tomorrow? That's the funny thing about love. You can take something so unconventional and annoying and still make it work in our own weird and special way. Turn right onto Willow Crest Avenue. Turn left onto Cleon Avenue. Turn right onto Chandler Boulevard. You have arrived at your destination.